behind me are three popular stretches from Oz Tents. They're all quite similar, they're set up the same way, but there's a little bit of difference in the dimensions. I'm gonna tell you all about them. Let's get started. Hit it. Get a break then from Snowy's here today. I've got next to me Oz Tents popular stretches, the Goanna stretcher, the Gecko stretcher, and the King Goanna stretcher. Now these guys all set up very similarly. The frame sort of, the, the way the frame folds is the same on all of them. The fabrics on top are the same 600 denier polyester and it's the same sort of around about one centimeter padding in here as well. Same powder coated steel, same 150 kilogram weight rating and they all come with the same warranty. The difference between them all are the dimensions and obviously the pack size as well. The Goanna being the smallest through to the King Goanna, the largest at the other end there. A little bit of difference in the weight. So we start at 10 kilos here. We go up to 10 and a half kilos for the Goanna stretcher and 11 and a half kilos for the King Goanna at the other end there. Now, before I run into all the dimensions of the setup stretches, I've got three the three carry bags here all packed up. And to give you sort of a representation of the difference in size, I'm just gonna put them all side by side. Now these are empty, these bags, but you can get an idea of the pack size just from looking on top there. Now they all, um, with the, this starting at the, the um, Goanna stretcher here, we've got the Gecko stretcher in the middle here and the King Goanna at the end there. So now the King Goanna is the longest, obviously it's about 105 centimeters in length, about 13 centimeters in depth and about 18 centimeters in height. Now that's probably the longest, skinniest one. The Gecko stretcher being um, a, a slightly shorter and a little fatter, it's about 94, 95 centimeters in length. Uh, about 16 centimetres in depth and about 20 centimetres high, so a little bit higher than the King Goanna here. And then the Gecko at the front here, sorry, the Go um, Goanna stretcher at the front here, I'm getting confused. About 93, 94 centimetres in length, also about 14 centimetres in depth and 20 centimetres in height here as well. So you can see there, there's not a lot of difference until you get up to the King Goanna, but there is a bit of difference in the pack size. Now let's uh, cover up some dimensions on these stretchers. We'll start with the height. Now the Goanna stretcher here being the lowest one is 39 centimetres to the top of the bar here. If we move up to the Go uh, Gecko stretcher, sorry here, 49 centimetres to the top of the bar, which is the same height as the King Goanna stretcher over here. Now the height measurements are to the top of this hard bar here, so that's not gonna change, but what you'll find is the fabric in the middle does sag down a little and it will, it'll stretch a little bit over time as well. Not a lot, it's a good durable polyester, but it will stretch a little bit. So. The overall height on the side isn't the same as the height of where you might be sleeping on the stretcher. In terms of the uh, width and lengths of the stretchers, starting with the Goanna stretch here, 190 centimetres in length, and that's from the very outside of the bar, so the foot in there, the very furthest point at the foot end up to the head end here, which is the outer edge of the bar here, and same with the width, 66 centimetres from this outside edge here to this outside edge here. Coming up to the gecko stretcher here, we've got 190 centimetres in length once again from very end to very end, and 80 centimetres in width from these outer edges here. And then moving up to the bigger stretcher over here, also 80 centimetres from edge to edge, and it's now 210 centimetres from this edge here to the same edge at the foot end there. Now there are other considerations to make with uh, with the usable space on these stretchers because obviously you're not gonna sleep on on the bars on the side here. So of this 80 centimetres of width, you probably need to take about 10 centimetres off for usable space. So you're coming in about five centimetres from each edge here. So you're clear of the bars on the side. And same with the foot end here. If you take about five centimetres off, you're inside the bar there. So in reality, it's about 200 centimetres by about 70 centimetres of usable space on this mat here. And you do the same, take the same measurements off the smaller mats, uh, smaller, um, stretches, sorry, below us here. The other consideration to make is the bars on the end of these are slightly longer. This end here sticks out a little, and if we come back over this end here, it also sticks out a little. That's longer there to assist with setup. These here, if you, if you add this one and the one on the other side here as well, adds about 11 centimeters to the total width of the stretcher. So if you're trying to fit it in a space, you need to take the 80 centimeters add about another 11 centimetres to it. So it's 91 centimetres absolute external dimensions if you're kind of fitting it between two sort of hard surfaces. So just a few considerations around how you're gonna, or the space you've got to sleep on the mattress and also how you might be able to fit a mattress inside a tent. Now that is three stretches from Oz Tents range, the Goanna, the Gecko and the King Goanna. These are 
reliable and durable. They're tried and tested stretches. They all offer the same level of comfort. The only difference is you need to choose one that's maybe gonna fit in your tent or if you just want space and you've got space to put it in, just grab the biggest one. They're all well made and we know that they work. You can grab them online at snowies.com.au at our lowest prices every day. If you've got any questions though, let us know down in the comments below. Subscribe to our channel. We'll send you all of our latest information or uh, check out some other videos like this one down here.